Hey, welcome back to Spot on Wines. This week we have. Uh, hello, Pluto. Hey, Massimo. How are you? Good. This week we have two wines uh, that we'll be featuring. We're going to be tasting just one, which is the Heron Pinot Noir, and the second featured wine is La Posta Malbec from Argentina. Just scored 90 points in Wine Spectator. Uh, a truly magnificent wine. Okay. Uh, you wanna... well, Filippo had problems. Uh, his carpal tunnel is coming back, so. Okay, now. I uh, just wanted to tell you about this wine a little bit, Max. Sure. Heron uh, Pinot Noir. Uh, it's actually from France. And um, anytime that I drink Pinot Noir, I'm reminded of that. I'm reminded of that movie Sideways, uh, Miles' um, uh, soliloquy, uh, that passionate soliloquy about uh, Pinot Noir, how they tend to grow in cer certain spots in the world, certain corner, hidden away. This one is from Lemieux, France. Y you're okay? It's just got Tough. weird. But go on. Uh, from Lemieux, France. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. Uh, not a Burgundy uh, by all stretch of the more imagination, but you're not going to find a Pinot Noir. Clean? Clean Pinot Noir uh, at this price point from Burgundy, obviously, as well. Uh, Philippe, this is a Pinot Noir, and this week we have a guest speaker. He has brought McManus into Glassboro. Um, Filippo calls him Fabio for his obvious good looks and physique. Mm -hmm. Uh, I personally belong. Uh, think he belongs in uh, movies as an axe murderer, uh, but everybody else knows him, knows him as Vladi. Vladi, come on in, Vladi. Oh, come Here comes Vladi. Welcome to the show. Oh, Vladi. Uh, how are you? Oh, hello. Uh, hey, Max. Vladi. Vladi, here on Pinot Noir this week. Uh, you seem to be an expert in this varietal, so we thought. Oh, we love it. We'd get your feet wet. Well. Great nose right there. Very nice. It's got a hint of um, old world in it. Mm -hmm. Vanilla, can, some good spice. You can tell. You can tell that it's it's it's, it's got a full body, not like your conventional Pinot Noir from. Uh, it's got a little bit more body from California. Absolutely. Both these wines this week, eleven ninety nine, and this Malbec is fifteen ninety nine. If you purchase them both together, it will be twenty four ninety nine. It's a savings of over ten percent if you purchase both of them at the same time. I'm pumped! What do you think, Vladdy? That's great. A bit of aroma to it. A little bit bitey, though. Mm -hmm. For a regular Pinot Noir. For the French ones. And um, what kind of cheese would you pair with this? Oh, we do the Burgundy cheese. Mm -hmm. All of the Bourgogne from France. Which Bourgogne. That actually looks like a brie, but it's not a brie. It's like a soft red French cheese. So we do that mm -hmm. perfectly. Look for your wine tip for the week. Do you have one? I do have one, Max. It's about drinking white wines not too cold. Uh, prefer preferably at about 46 to 48 degrees. Uh, that brings out a lot more of their aromas and their uh, uh, flavors. Uh, they're too cold. If they're too cold, it tends to hide some of the flavors. Take that tip with you, Massimo. Yes. To the bank. Okay. All right. Until yeah. next week, and I know a lot of you can't wait for it. Cheers. 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 Thanks, Vlad. Cheers.